explain what it's like to represent your country and in the Olympics and you know just kind of walk somebody through what that what that mindset is like well I, I think when you get to the Olympic Games you get the clothing you get the outfits you get every shirt that says USA across you march in the opening ceremonies with all your countrymen with the US flag um, it's special and, and it's something you don't get a chance to do. I've said this before. Like I said, it's not all L.A., it's not Harrisburg or Pittsburgh or Philadelphia. It's the United States. And there aren't many opportunities as an athlete that you get to represent your country. There are Super Bowls, there are Stanley Cups, there are World Series games. But there's few Olympics, there's few World Championships, there's few Ryder Cups. Um, very few times do you get a chance to represent your country in a sporting event. So when you have that, and especially the Olympic Games, it's pretty special. It's a very proud moment. Now, speaking of history, you mentioned that um, you know that you had the adversity of being going up against the Russians and going up against the Soviet team. What was it like playing that championship game? I, I don't think enough people know like no, how, how much went into that's that. That's to me what's funny. People think we played one game. Mm -hmm. You know, we had to beat uh, a Czechoslovakian team that was supposed to beat us. We had to beat West Germany that was supposed to beat us. We tied Sweden. You know, people forget about those games. If we didn't win those games, we wouldn't even be playing the Soviets. And then we beat the Soviets, and now we have to play Sunday morning. And a lot of people didn't know this, that if we lost our tied Sunday, we could have come in fourth place, not even won a medal. So we didn't go to the Olympics to win one game. We went with the hope and dreams of winning the whole thing. And the Finland game was the biggest game for us. If we lose to Finland, do I really care about the you know, Soviet game? Yeah, it's nice to say you won, but it didn't bring us anything. We wanted to win the ultimate prize, and we were able to do that. You know, our moment was something that was very special. It, it touched a lot of people's lives in, in a lot of different ways. And, uh, and I was just telling the story yesterday. I'm from New England, and I was rooting for the Patriots, but they didn't win, and people in New England weren't happy, but people in Philly were, and other people didn't care. But when it's the Olympic Games, it's a nation, and that feels a part of us. And I think in 1980, we clearly touched that nation. And now, you know, with the movie Miracle that come out, there's a new generation of, uh, of fans who uh, kind of know our story, and it's, and it's a great story.